shame. It says right here that children are reading books less and less because of technology. Well, Mama, Google does tell us a lot. Google is not a book, and Google cannot stimulate your mind how a book can. I know, but the internet is just so much faster. See, that's the problem. The world has turned to everything being fast. What happened to the days when reading books were fun? Children wanted to go to the library and kids would sit on the porch and read. Anyway, back in my day, we enjoyed reading a good book. Well, thankfully we're in this day now where we have Google. <laughs> Be quiet, Coco. Anyway, listen to this. According to the National Literacy Trust, there has been a 26% decrease in the number of children and young people age 8 to 18 who read daily in their free time since 2005. Oh. Oh, and this. According to literacyproj.org, currently 45 million Americans are functionally illiterate and cannot read above fifth grade level. This is nuts, right, Coco? Uh, oh, wow, that's crazy. Now, why would they go do that? Oh my goodness, now this is crazy. According to KRTV.com, more than one in three children arrive at kindergarten without the skills necessary for lifetime learning. Oh, wow. Mama, that would not be my story, okay? Look, see, Mama, look, I just started reading this book and it is so good. Oh, really? That is good. See, my baby is different. That's a big book, though. I know, which gives me even more to do. But, Mama, I'll be done reading it in about a week. A week? Really? Yes, a week. I'm telling you, watch. Okay, well, I will leave you to read. I'm going to go get some work done. Okay, well, I'll just be over here reading and enjoying my new book. All right, see you later. Yep, all right, reading my book now. <laughs> All right, the boy went to the store in the dark. Woo, all right, she's gone. Time to watch some TV. <laughs> you know what, Coco? Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot you were reading. It's so nice to see you doing that. I was just checking in on you. Yep, just me and my book, Mama. It is so good. Oh, really? What's it about? Look, you know, it's about this boy, and he had to go to the store, and uh, he went in the dark, and he met somebody along the way, but, uh, you, you, you know, he kept going and going, and you, but mama, I have to get through the book first, and I haven't yet, but I'm sure it's gonna be good. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, well, it has a weird title that looks like it's missing a word. Uh, oh, you know, th that's just how they do it now for the younger generation. <laughs> Oh, okay. Well, go ahead and get back to reading. Uh, all right. Okay. It's just me and my book. All right. Okay, wait. I messed up. Mama thinks there's really words in this book, but there's absolutely nothing because I haven't been reading anything. Now I have to make up what this book is about. Oh, oh wait. Hold on. That show is on. done <laughs> really how that book has like 200 pages of pure entertainment it just kept me going you know coco i just read it all <laughs> oh really so what did it end up being about oh this book um it, it was just about a boy and um his friends and they were in the dark um as i told you i think i told you that part. but you know they had went to the tree and they had built a tweet house and inside the tree house um, was a uh, bird, no, a uh, squirt. It was food inside the deal. So they just decided to eat because they were hungry. But it ended up being very delicious, if you ask me. What? Mm -mm. Let me see this book. Uh, oh, no, no, give me, uh, give me uh, some uh, book. Okay, uh, wait. Hold on. You don't look too fast now. Yeah, okay. Where are the words? What words? That go in the book. Well, they gotta be around here somewhere. I'm not really sure if I've seen them, but, uh... Constance Streety, what have you been doing this whole time? I, I just watched a little TV. And fooled me thinking that this was a real book? 
you were so excited and I didn't want to hurt your feelings. My feelings? I just told you how a lot of people in this world can't read and you chose a book with no words? You know what this means, punishment. Oh man, for, for how long? For life, now go read a real book. All right. Now, now Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble with pretty pigtails. Mama. Can I have some? No, 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 Coco. That is not for kids, okay? Okay. All right, look, I'm going to lay down. I'll be back. Okay, I'll be down here, okay? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I, Coco, me, will not drink the drink. No, you, you a good girl. doing nothing just being good well you shouldn't be touching mommy's drink that's not for us I'm not whatever I, I think I'm just gonna sip just a little bit <laughs> <laughs> Coco! Why'd you do that? What's up? Why are you all making all of this noise? She she's being weird. Here's the problem. Coco, did you drink my energy drink? No, mama, I didn't drink it. Like you said, I just I I sipped it. Let, let me let me get some more. No! in so much trouble. Mama, do you understand the words that is coming out of my mouth? You said don't drink it. I sipped it. Sip, sip. Your mouth is what's about to get you in trouble. Go to your room, Coco. <laughs> okay. I'ma go, but I'ma dance. <laughs> You're about to get in trouble. <laughs> about to get my belt. No, no. Come here, little girl. Now, now, Coco. You know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty pigtails and a smile that makes us giggle. What can we say? That's just Coco being Coco. Now, now, Coco. You know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty pigtails and a smile that makes us giggle. What can we say? That's just Coco being Coco.